So it's been more than a minute since I've done a video. I have been extremely busy. On top of that, we have had uh, something called rain. We had three days of it last week. Um, so it's just a little bit different. My garden doesn't know how to react, everything else. But I do have some clips and stuff that I've captured. So this is going to be a bit of a different video. A conglomerate of what is going on. And I'm going to... It is what it is. I'm busy and I work full time, so I'm trying my best to upload, but it's really hard. Be sure to check out my Instagram. I do tend to post quite a few pictures throughout the week on there um, if you want to stay up to date and see what's going on in the garden. Prize, the grounds crew where I work is super awesome and look what they gave me. So I made this compost bin quite a while ago and I've just had issues with producing enough waste for it. Like I really didn't think about that. I was like, go big or go home, no other way to do it. Well, there is other ways to do it. And I should have made a much more smaller one for my house. Um, so I was able to get a bunch of green grass and some pine needles, which I'm going to throw into here so they can start composting with everything else that's in there, which has now turned to brown material. So I am up bright and early on a Saturday, my day to sleep in, <clears throat> because I'm pretty sure gardening's gotten a little extreme for me, so I'm gonna go pick up some worm tea, which for you those who don't know, it's pretty much just like worm ex like excrete, like so it's like poo, like pee kinda. Um, <clears throat> and then I'm hoping to get some worm um, compost, I don't know what you, I'm blanking right now. However, it is pretty much worm poop. So I think my gardening's gotten kind of extreme and then following that I'm hoping to go hit a farmer's market that I'm really excited about that's going to be on my side of town for once. So I have forgiven sleeping in and I'm going to get my hippie on. I am still having major bug infestation issues so I am going to release some ladybugs. Ooh, they're in there and they're starting to wake up. I just pulled them out of the refrigerator. So I'm gonna release these into my garden while it is dark outside and hopefully they'll eat all the bugs, although it has been raining. So hopefully they'll have a nice little habitat to go into. So let's get this started. There goes a little ladybug. There goes another one. So I still got a couple, look how big my peppers are getting. There's one too. Another one. Another one up there. So I think they're eating. We'll see. And yet, it is another Sunday. Um, I have a lot I want to get done. I haven't been able to work on my garden the way I've wanted to or get a lot of stuff done it's been really hot but today it's not too bad it's only 99 which is like phenomenal for us here so i've already been doing work cleaning up the yard i was out pretty late last night so i'm just gonna work show you kind of what i'm doing um some updates i'm really trying to fight various bugs in my garden right now so just going at it um so yeah i figured i'd take you along i want to put down some more soil so i can get to planting kind of freshen it up and then get my fall garden started. I have quite a few things I want to plant, so I'm gonna get that underway and we're just gonna see where this goes. Start putting down my soil that I want to add in here because I like took some out and now I got a big hole and I keep falling in it. Um, and for some reason, like some of my soil is not compacting right. So yes, I'm just gonna keep working and see where I get.
I want to give a quick update where I'm at on the garden. I said hot and at because I am just sweating profusely. So I just removed my entire drip system because I wanted to put it back in a different way. Um, and I realized my infestations with the aphids isn't gone. That's what I think they are. That's what uh, all the forums I've been on. I've posted pictures. That's what everyone says. So let's go ahead and peek in here. So the drip system that I had, I got taken off. I put in a couple stakes uh, to help. But when we come over here, for example, I saw a bunch on my pepper plant. Look at that. That's just like crazy. I don't fucking understand it. So I think I'm just going to have to be very, very... And look, there's a ladybug. Why is not the ladybug eating the fucking aphids? I'm just going to keep going along. Getting some red ones. Yuck. I'm getting bugs all over me. I got this one coming up. Finally. And one thing that has occurred since the rain is this guy took off. So this is my cucumber. It was really struggling. Like there was a while I didn't think it was going to live. Um, down here I had started to grow but the rain just kind of killed it off. So I've been like eyeballing it. I do got some like minor things. I never seem to catch them in the process though. Um, so I got the min leaf miners. But this is like the first real time this one's flowering. So I don't see any like female flowers. But I am seeing flowers, some male flowers, which is good just because I didn't have any flowers for the longest time on this one. Like all summer, it has not had any flowers. So that's a big deal. Um, these, and this one has been going since April. Not one thing produced off of it. But I've kept it alive. And now it's really tall. So we'll see. And then we come over here. Doo -doo -doo. And this is my little one that I started indoors just a few months ago, and I'm already maybe having stuff happening. I keep checking to see if I can see any new female flowers. Lots of males, which is good because I've heard of people getting too many females. Oh, oh. There it is, baby cucumber! Ah. Come over here. No flowers on this one, but it's still doing good. That one's getting lots of flowers. Well, there's two there. Two plants. One plant. One plant. And a pop-pop. Right there. That, that, that's a pop-pop. I'm not sure why he's outside, because he's going to cause troubles. Yeah, like... That's all like aphid poop or something. From my understanding. So I'm going to clean all that off and just keep working on them. Just keep working, just keep working, just keep working. Oh, yeah, some bitch. There they are, right there. I got, like, ants and something else. So spray it and try and treat it before it gets too bad. Yeah, look at that guy right there. Jalapenos. And keep working. Keep working. Never stop. And this is the next thing I'm hoping to get finished up that I haven't recorded as much as I would have wanted to. But I got the entire outside sealed, so now I just need to seal the under part of it um, to just help protect it and make it last. So I'm going to work on doing this, and we'll see how far I get tonight.